Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the Frostbites Gaming Experience. So we just got ourselves some brand new techniques. We actually bought one of the techniques. And we've taken care of, I believe, all the side quests that we can do for the time being. So let's go ahead and move on. Ah, you are back. I hope this unfortunate matter with the bandits has not caused undue stress. It caused me so much stress, so it took me a while to come back and record again. But many were saved. We, yeah, especially watching that one body blow up. That was something. These invaders discovered us by accident, but as you likely suspect, they are related to your destiny. Interesting. You have trained hard and are ready. You will have a pivotal role in some great events, my student. After you return from the spirit cave. The spirit cave, huh? I object. I'm sure you do. Gow. What is the meaning of this intrusion? He's been there this whole time. What intrusion? Your pet student is not the only one who fought those outlaws. Perhaps I did not stand in their midst on the beach like a fool, but I did my part. He ran away. If you spent less time coddling him, you would have many promising students instead of one. This is not a matter that can be decided by effort, Gao. There are things at play that you do not understand. Damn, get shut down, kid. I understand that this student has received preferential treatment, and I have suffered for it. Whatever is in this spirit cave, I am worthy of facing it, too. I'm sure you think you are. If he is truly better than me, let him prove it. I challenge him. Okay. I will not have you brawling in the street. If this must happen, it will happen in the ring as a proper test of your abilities. Sounds good to me. I'll whoop his ass either way. You are restricted to styles that I have taught. I know the dark tutoring your father, Gaul the Greater, has imparted, but I won't have any such sorcery here. Okay. Cobbled before I begin. Of course. How else would your precious protege win? Ooh, someone's salty. I do not trust Gaul to fight honorably. Consider your attacks carefully. Prepare yourself and return when you are ready. I believe I'm already ready. Remember the basics. Oh, I meant to say that I was completely ready. But no. that was the first one. I am ready now. There we go. The fighters meet in the arena. <laughs> I'm totally ready. In a minute. This challenge will continue until one of you is incapacitated. This is not a practice bout. Injury is a possibility. And I'm going to injure the hell out of him. Possibility. I think it is more than likely. Master, are you certain this is appropriate? Totally. You kidding me? Dispute, and this is the only way to settle it with certainty. It will be an honorable contest. I have restricted Gao from using his father's sorcery. No need to. I'll whoop his ass either way. I don't care. I said you would regret getting in my way. Fighters, begin. All right, so we're going to go ahead and start off with the Heavenly Way. Well, he's just going to come right in on us, huh? Ooh, going for a headbutt. Get ourselves a good couple kicks in while he's slowed. And then back out. I meant to actually use Heavenly Wave because you can use an AoE on the Heavenly Wave. And it gets the slow all the same. Ooh, he tricked me there with that. All right. Okay, I gotta be really careful with like hitting that. I think there. I wonder if there's like another way to take care of that. Always take advantage of them being slowed. Ooh, that was not good. And even when they're slowed, if they get like certain hits, it's not gonna do nearly as much. Get a lot of distance hits in. AoE. Ooh, he kind of jumped out right. Oh, wait, he jumped right back in. Why well, can get a second slow on him? And get a lot of good long range attacks in on him. Took a little bit of a hit there. Let's heal up really quick. Ooh, get beat down. Get staffed. Easy 200 experience. It is done. The, challenge has the AoE attacks can be pretty busted, especially with like Heavenly Wave, because again, it just gives you an AoE slow ability. 
And then the rest is just a knockback attack for no, groups. He used fire. Well then, that was simple. Gulf, I have made enough concessions to you today. I thought I could guide you away from your corrupted path, but you are too much the son of Gal the Greater. Oof. First he blocks your attack, then he insults you. Welcome among my students. And banishes you. House shall have no more business here, despite his influence. Oof. I was not beaten. Not by this peasant. Well, what do you call that then? Defeated by your own foolish ambition and predictable temper. Damn, this is like 10,000 IQ insulting here. And we're going to watch him hobble away. Hobble, 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 hobble. Everyone, this challenge is concluded. I'm sure the victor would appreciate your congratulations. They are well earned. Even if you talk with people, it doesn't really change anything. Enjoy the words of your fellows. You can use it as like a little pride boost, but really it doesn't do anything. Be certain you are ready when you come to me. Your life is about to change. Oof, hopefully for the better. That was exciting. I'm glad you are safe. I knew you would be. Your skill is unmatched. Even Gal had to see that. I suppose that's what set him off. God, she has totally got the hots for us, doesn't she? Punishment just makes him worse. Master Lee has bent like a willow to accommodate him and his sorcerer's father. All right, does we must confuse things? Yeah, Don't just we does we must. We're the nice sense. guy. Anticipation is grueling. So much could be happening that you just don't know about. And it's not. Let's not worry about all the things we don't know. Troubled spirits. I didn't ask to be a part of it. As much as you want to know more, I doubt you had a say in your fate either. It must get tough being able to talk with spirits, sorry, though. This is supposed to be a happy time. Yes, and you're killing the mood. Is waiting for and how are these leaves constantly falling, but none of them are building up on the ground? I feel like these leaves are fake. Anyways, we can talk to anybody, but again, it doesn't really gain us much of anything, so we're just going to continue onward. Uh, there you are. Have you finished all your business with your fellow students? Um, why are you talking to Gal when you say this? I'm right here. Oh wow, I literally jumped like right in front of them. Wait outside, Gal. I will finish with you later. Alright, let's find out what our destiny is. Hobble, hobble, hobble. And you don't even lock now, it. My student, there are many things ahead that you must is this even a soundproof yourself? room? I trust you know the importance of your destiny. No, we just actually kind of started playing the game. We're still like only an hour in. What's the next you step? Are an orphan, but you were not abandoned. You were rescued from the Temple of Dirge in the land of howling spirits. You were orphaned by violent action. Well then, that that's a that's a shame. I take responsibility for it. You see, I used to be more than a humble teacher. To learn of yourself, you must learn more of me. I was once leader of the Imperial Army. Dun 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 strategist. I am the brother of Emperor Sun. Well, that, that one power did call him, say that he had high strategy. He never said anything about this, but I believe that it's too incredible. Yeah, either way, it doesn't really matter. But first, we have an uninvited visitor. Where? Spirits are everywhere. That was a weird jump cut right there. Gao never could keep his ears to himself. We're a little close there. When angry, so predictable. He's heard as much as I wanted him to. Perhaps it will give him a little perspective. Why did we have to be that close to you for that line, though? Because who knows what lies within? That includes you and me both. All right, why are you hiding the truth of his brother? And I'm not sure. Believe it. Well, it doesn't matter either way. He seized your homeland during the long drought. It was an aggressive change in the empire that would soon bring death's hand to power. I withdrew my support and tried to rally your people against the siege I had helped plan. A doomed effort. Many died on both sides. Sun Kin, another brother, also fell. Damn. Listen, I will tell you how you came into my care. Time for backstory. 
I don't want to skip. some fight. At least you got a couple hits in before going down. Gave the guy all the time in the world to leave, but then he spent forever just waiting for it. Good job, Lee. That baby should be freaking the fuck out right now. The thing in that baby is us. We're more chill than that. That's not a great hiding spot. They can clearly see that you're there. An amulet. Well, there's some screaming going on there. Ooh, yo, he totally saw you. Something happened. Get out, Lee. And they lived happily ever after. The end. Your people were killed. I am haunted by it, and now the world may join me. The assassin on the beach was a lotus assassin. Ooh. A minion of death's hand. More will come. That's why you could teleport. Tell me anything about my people. Who is... Okay, yeah, who is this death's hand? The right hand of the emperor and rules the lotus assassins in place of Prince Sun Kin, who was killed at Dirge, a death he may have orchestrated. So, seems like he's our main baddie along with the emperor. Dun, 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 and all that Star Wars jazz. No doubt he is utterly evil. Ooh, utterly. I have never faced him, but I know of no one living who has. Hmm. Dark energy sustains him. That is the armor of a man who has no remorse, no pity. Sounds like my kind of guy. All right, tell me what has to do with my destiny. You were meant for something important. But because of my actions, it was denied you. Stories about ghosts, the assassin on the beach, you are tied to this. How? Our dead no longer drift to the underworld. Okay. They wander lost, going mad. In time, they may overwhelm the living. It began when your people were destroyed. Really? Why haven't you? Why haven't I witnessed this? We are on the edge of the Empire, and not all spirits make their presence known. Oh. We are not immune, but I kept you isolated. This information could endanger you. Well, that was nice of him. The first assassin found us by accident. The next attack may not be so unfocused. To fix the world, you may threaten the power of some dangerous people. Eh, we like living life on the edge. The spirit cave will make things as clear as they can be. Only you are meant to understand what is within. You will see the corruption of the spirit. So basically, people that died are not going to the underworld and they're just roaming our world. That's about it. Is it safe? No, but <clears throat> places truly are. This has been a lot to comprehend. So take and we got to make sure that that kind of stops happening. Inside. You know, too many spirits so go roaming around, causing problems with everybody, and eventually they're going to overpopulate. Because, you, you know, no more, more people die. Well, no, more people are born than expect. people that die. But even then, if they die and then they're ghostly, you know spirit is still roaming around it's going to cause a lot of confusion and chaos with a lot of people so now let's go down into the spirit cave to see what we can figure out here as we save the game so what have we got down here let's see what this gate has to tell us uh bears a clay seal a message is a card across the surface and master lee's handwriting spirits go mad <laughs> yeah thanks lee Disrupted and can't ref 
form for a time. So basically, we can't do anything about them. We can just Much shame them. To the reason why spirits wander. Many appeared after your people fell, and some I held in this cave. They are drawn to your amulet. It is a head waiting for you. Oh. Be careful. It is desired by many seeking power beyond the mortal realm. Of course. I make no apology for these trials, my student. You will come to see how necessary they are. Unless they kill me, in which case it's all your fault. Alrighty, so that was our first point of interest back there, just opening the door. Alright, see what we got here. So we have a Voss. Easy 55. Bamboo casks. With nothing. Another Voss. Another 45. Ooh, and a health. Well, let's see what we got here. We have a pillar with an amulet on it. Pillar stone contains some of the metallic object with it carved into a crystalline surface. The encryption. The was with you in Dirge. I understand what it does, but you are the one meant to be trained in its use. I am sorry that my actions denied you this. That's fine. Essence gems are used by healers and upstart sorcerers and are common enough to be wasted on ornamentation. But with this amulet, you can tap their true potential. All right, I'm all for that. <laughs> Pretty. Whoa! Hey, it floats too. Alrighty, so Dragon Amulet is your birthright and a tool for focusing your spiritual powers. As you travel in Jade Empire, you will find gems that enhance your abilities. Place these gems in the sockets of the Dragon Amulet to gain access to their power. So we have one gem, which is the Flawed Warrior Gem, and it gives us body plus one. That is it. And we have three total slots used. The two eyes, and I believe the center, if I'm not exactly mistaken. But I think later on we can power it up where we can get up to, I think it's like five slots or six Unless I could be 100% mistaken on that, do not quote me on it. It still has been a long time since I last played this game. I do not fully remember, but I do think I remember that the amulet can get more than just three gems later on. Even mindless spirits may be drawn to you, just as they were confined here. In achieving your true power, you become a target that many will not be able to resist. Yeah, well, it gives me more experience. All right, so now let us fight some spirits. Oh yeah, that's right. So the spirits are immune to weapons because it is the fact that we are a spirit monk that we are capable of physically hitting them. Heal up. But yeah, you cannot hit a spirit with a weapon because only you, like, physically can actually harm them. Get some more healing in, get all our chi back, and let's move onward. Get the rest of the health off of that. Alright, so another clay type of writing. Hold the amulet. Glows brighter. My student, I hope you realize your importance. The restless dead must be allowed to find their way. The restless the dead await. All of us will suffer if things continue as they are. Seek the source of this problem and eradicate it. That is your purpose and burden. I hope that the basics I have taught you will aid you in setting everything right. I do like how chillax he is now with the second door blowing open. But we are going to call it a part right there, ladies and gentlemen. So I do hope you enjoyed the rest of your evenings. We'll catch you all in the next part.